हेलो वेलकम टू अ सेशन ऑन इंट्रोडक्शन टू अपाची पिग अपाची पिग इज अ प्लेटफॉर्म फॉर डेटा एनालिसिस दिस इज डॉक्टर नीता पूजा प्रोफेसर इन कंप्यूटर साइंस एंड इंजीनियरिंग डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ वर्ल्ड चेन इंस्टीट्यूट टेक्नोलॉजी सोलापुर देर आर सम प्री रिक्विजिट्स लर्नर शुड हैव अ गुड अंडरस्टैंडिंग ऑफ हडूप एच डी एफ एस कमांड्स एंड एस क्यू एल एट द एंड ऑफ द सेशन स्टूडेंट्स विल गेट फेमिलियर टू वॉट इज अपाची पिग वॉट आर द फीचर्स ऑफ पिग एनाटॉमी एंड पिग फिलोसॉफी पिग ई टी एल प्रोसेसिंग एडवांटेजेस एंड लिमिटेशन ऑफ पिग ना वॉट इज पिग पिग इज अ हाई लेवल प्रोग्रामिंग लैंग्वेज विच इज यूजफुल फॉर एनालाइजिंग लार्ज डेटा सेट्स दैट इज डेटा सेट्स विच आर इन द साइज ऑफ टेरा बाइट्स एंड पेंटा बाइट्स पिग इज एन अल्टरनेटिव टू मैप प्रोड्यूस प्रोग्रामिंग it is generally used with hadoop that is we can perform all the data manipulation operations in hadoop using apache pig but apache pig works on the top of hadoop it is built on the top of hadoop it is an abstraction over map reduce the pig programming language is designed to work on upon any kind of data it provides a very good scripting language called as pig latin for data analysis programmers need to write scripts using pig latin language which is internally converted to map and reduce tasks apache pig has a very good component called as pig engine that accepts the pig latin scripts as inputs and converts these scripts into map reduce jobs now why do we need apache pig pig latin helps programmers to perform map reduce tasks easily without having to type complex programs or codes in java some programmers they are not good at all in java especially when they want to write map reduce tasks for hadoop they find it very very difficult for writing the map reduce task in java it nearly takes 200 lines of code but for but for doing the same task in apache pig we hardly need 10 lines of code so for such programmers apache pig is a boon it uses multi query approach thereby reducing the length of the codes pig is oriented around batch processing of data if you need to process gigabytes or terabytes of data pig is a very good choice but it expects to read all the records of a file and write all of its output sequentially apache pig provides many built in operators to support data operations like joins filters ordering etc now these are all traditional operations but in addition to this it also provides nested data types like tuples bags and maps that are missing from normal map reduce in java now let's see some of the features of the pig first is extensibility using the existing operators users can develop their own functions to read process and write data that is they can write down their own user defined functions next udfs that is pig provides a facility to create user defined functions in other programming languages such as java and embed them in pig scripts pig handles all kinds of data that is analyze all kinds of data both structured as well as unstructured form it can even analyze metadata key value stores and databases it stores the results in hdfs pig provides a rich set of operators that is it provides many operators to perform operations like join sort filter etc ease of programming that is pig latin is very similar to sql it is very easy to write a pig script provided you are good at sql optimization opportunities the task in apache pig optimize the execution automatically so the programmers need to focus only on the semantics of the language they need not bother about the optimized version of the execution now let's see the anatomy of pig the main components of pig are as follows first one is a data flow language that is pig latin is called as data flow language because it allows the users to design the reading of input from multiple sources 
process the data and store the results into multiple machines that is multiple nodes that is why it is known as data flow language. Second, it provides an interactive shell where you can type pig Latin statements and that shell is called as a grunt shell. Third is a pig interpreter and execution ex uh, engine which interprets the pig Latin scripts and executes accordingly. So you can see that in the first box a pig Latin script has been written that is A is equal to load student roll number name and grade point analysis. Then we filter A by grade point analysis that is we choose only those records where the students have grade point analysis greater than 4.0 and we store it in A. Then for each record in A we generate an upper version of the name that is we store the upper case of the name and we store it into a file called as my report. Now pig interpreter it processes and parses pig latin scripts checks data types, performs optimization, creates MapReduce jobs and submits these jobs to Hadoop and it monitors the progress. Now Hadoop takes all MapReduce jobs, distributes them on the multiple nodes and executes them parallelly. Now we will pause the video, think on this question and try to answer it. PIG should be used in which of the following cases? Should it be used when there is a time constraint? Or should it be used when your data is completely in the unstructured form? Or when you want to get analy uh, analytical insights through sampling? Or when you want to process various data sources? Obviously, option A cannot be chosen here because the PIG Latin scripts are executed slowly. The MapReduce jobs written in PIG Latin scripts, they execute slowly as compared to MapReduce task written in Java. So when there is a time constraint, I cannot use PIG. When your data is completely in the unstructured form, which is the second option, no, PIG can work on any type of data that is whether data is in unstructured form, structured form or nested form. When you want to get analytical insights through sampling, that is data analysis, obviously PIG can be used. And PIG is a, called as a data flow language, that is PIG Latin is called as data flow language because it processes the data from various data sources parallelly and then stores the output on multiple nodes parallelly. So option C and D can be definitely applicable to where the PIG should be used. Now let's see the pig philosophy. Pigs eat anything. Pigs live anywhere. Pigs are domestic animals and pigs fly. So all these four philosophies, they have a particular meaning associated with the pig. Now let's see that. Pig eat anything. That means PIG can process different kinds of data such as structured and unstructured data as we have already discussed. PIGs live anywhere. PIG not only processes files in HDFS but it also processes files in all the resources such as files even in the local file system. PIGs are domestic animals because PIGs allows you to develop user defined functions in any programming language and embed them in PIG Latin scripts and the same can be handled for complex operations. Pigs fly means pigs process data very quickly. Now let's see what is the ETL processing in pig. So these are the use cases. Pigs run jobs on clusters. So it collects data from multiple sources such as ERP, accounting sections, flat files, then it validates the data, then it fixes the errors or debugs the errors in that uh, data, that is it removes all the noises from it, then it removes all the duplicates, then it encodes the value and finally the clean data which is ready to be analyzed is stored in the data warehouse.
now let's discuss some of the advantages of apache pig apache pig takes less development time because the map reduced tasks that are written in pig latin scripts are very smaller that is hardly some 10 to 15 lines of code which is equal to 200 lines of code if the map reduced task is written in java so development time is obviously very less for the map reduced jobs in pig latin scripts easy to learn because it is very similar to SQL, the one who is very familiar with SQL can learn Apache Pig also very easily and very fast. It is a procedural language. It is a data flow language because it allows the users to read the data simultaneously from multiple sources, process it simultaneously and simultaneously generate results and store it on multiple nodes. It is easy to control execution in Apache Pig. It allows the user defined functions to be written in any programming language and embedded in pig latin scripts. It uses a lazy evaluation technique. It is, it uses the Hadoop features for processing the data. Of course, it is very effective for unstructured data and it is basically a pipeline system. Now, let us see some of the limitations of Apache pig. Now, pig's errors are not easily interpretable and solved. Apache pig is not enough matured. It does not support much of the other platforms. It has implicit data schema and of course, there is a delay in execution because MapReduce jobs written in pig Latin scripts execute slowly as compared to the MapReduce jobs written in Java. Now, these are some of the references. Thank you.